Alert, Demare accused of child rape gives despicable excuse for his crimes. Across the country, Americans are wising up to the degenerate, morally bankrupt nature of the Democrat Party. Seattle long a hot spot for progressivism is up in arms over the child rape committed by its sitting mayor, Ed Murray. One of Murray's closest associates is offering a defense on behalf of the mayor that is truly sickening. According to him, what Murray did happened so long ago that it shouldn't matter anymore, via Seattle Times. Murray is under fire thanks to a report by Oregon Child Protective Services, CPS, from the 80s. The report concludes that Murray sexually abused his foster son, Jeff Simpson. Murray was disqualified from ever being a foster parent in Oregon again. Naturally, Murray has denied the accusations, despite their conclusive nature. Although Seattle's openly gay mayor was not criminally charged at the time, the prosecutor assigned to the case stated that charges were withdrawn due to Simpson's delicate mental state not because Murray was innocent. Jeff Simpson was not the only young man to be abused by Murray. Other have previously come forward to detail how they were harmed throughout the years by Seattle's Democrat mayor, via Washington Times. For Murray and his associates, you can get away with anything as long as you're a Democrat. Bruce Harrell, Seattle City Council president and close supporter of Murray, offered this shocking defense of the offender in question. We just don't know. And I would ask that I don't want to be judged for anything 33 years ago. And I would challenge each of you to think about where you were 33 years ago. The question is are you doing your job today, right now? Via Como News. He's saying that because Murray sexually abused these kids three decades ago, it doesn't matter. Somehow the passing of time negates the sick crime committed by this despicable pervert? Harrell is just as bad as Murray. Time may have passed for Murray, but it hasn't for the people he molested. Victims of sexual abuse will tell you that the pain stings throughout their lives. The trauma continues to affect them even into adulthood. It's a gross injustice that Murray has been allowed to roam the streets and participate in politics for so long. He deserves to be in prison. No one can deny Murray is guilty. He even called off his re-election bid because of this scandal. Jeff Simpson is prepared to bring back charges once Murray is out of office. Hopefully, justice is served. The way to prevent these leftist creeps from harming our children is to have harsh penalties for those who are caught. We're a nation of justice. It's infuriating. How was a single, declared gay man permitted to take young boys into his home? What did the social workers think was going to happen? Liberal Oregon was a lost cause even back then. Enough of political correctness. It's putting our children in danger. Stop the debating. We want action. Kick Murray out of office, bring him to trial and throw him in jail. Then, let's start purging our country of all the leftist sickos infesting our government. Should Ed Murray resign immediately? Share this story on Facebook and let us know because we want to hear your voice.